Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Our main event of the evening is upon us. The moment of truth. Set your mind, the Combat Sports Board of Victoria and the VABL. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, fighting out of Clyde and representing the three, nine, seven, eight, making his debut. Please welcome Josh Bubba Richard! Well, Dom, here he is. Josh the Bomber Richards. And his opponent fighting out of sail via the way of Manila in Philippines, also making his debut. Please welcome John Go! This is our main event of the evening. It is time to separate the men from the boys. Sent you by the VABL and the Combat Sports Board of Victoria. Our judges at ringside, Jeff Eddy, Peter Flaherty, and Paul Lee. Board members, Michael Ashton, Scotty Brower. Our physician at ringside, Dr. Pratab Phillip, and our timekeeper, Chris Anderson, Jr. When the action begins, our referee in charge is Mr. Chris the sound of singing. And now, ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment of truth. Are you ready? Melbourne Pavilion, are you ready? Without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, it's fight time! Time to separate the men from the boys. Playtime is over. Four by three minute rounds in the featherweight division. Introducing first to my left, fighting out of the blue corner, trained by Jake Catherall from Team Genesis. Official weight, 55.6 kilograms. Standing five feet, five and a half inches tall. Fighting out of five, the 3978. And tonight we're in the all black fight shorts, making his debut. And fighting out of Clyde, please welcome Josh Bubba Richards! And his opponent to my right, fighting out of the red corner, Trey May Nick Lund from Lightning Fight Center. Official weight, 56.2 kilograms. Standing five feet, eight and a half inches tall. Tonight wearing the black shorts with the yellow trim. Also making his debut. Fighting out of sail via way of Manila in the Philippines. This is John Gordejos. Fighter Sue Center, please. Final instructions. They take themselves a little time and listen to me a little time. One punch in the back of the head, one hold, get the punches up. When I say something, you do it, okay? Nice and clean. Good luck, boys. Go back to the corner and wait for the bell. Here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Right, ladies and gentlemen, the fighters are ready, the judges are ready. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to make 
make some noise! Second round, round one. And here we go, the main event of the evening. John Corteos taking it on to Josh Richards. This is a four by three minute round. Both of these fighters very experienced. This fight has been highly anticipated. And certainly, uh, if the crowd's any testament, they are looking for Josh to take away the win. Easier said than done. John Corteos is quite, uh, quite the fighter. Again, we've got the Southpaw and Orthodox. I might also add, Nick, it uh, highly anticipated and long awaited. These boys have uh, rescheduled numerous times. Nick Lund bringing the wanted fights to you at Fight Night 56. And the crowd are hot for Mr. Richards, for Josh Richards. The chant going around ringside. Josh sitting in the middle of the ring, trying to cut John off as John circles. Nice uppercut there from John. Big right hand. Yeah, Jake just seems to be just out of range. Yeah, he's got to uh, he's got to close that distance, doesn't he? Yeah. Here we go, seconds out. this four-round fight. John taking the initiative early in this round. And Josh just can't seem to quite get his timing down yet, but he'll certainly, uh, he'll certainly come good for sure. He might need to just risk a little bit more to get that reward. Yeah, 
trying to throw that counter left hand straight down the barrel. Those beautiful onward gloves. Yeah, John goes to the body with some success there. Josh is going to have to throw ones, twos, but threes and fours. Yeah, I think you're right, Lee. He's going to he's going to need to scrap it up. He's going to yeah. need to get in there. Slip it a miss. And the full house is absolutely on fire here tonight. John's looking very comfortable here. He's not in a rush. Nice body shot there from Corteos. And it's the end of the round. Two, two down, two to go. I think Josh knows what he's got to do. A little look of frustration on his face as he walks back to his corner. Capability to take this away. Yeah, be a brave man to uh, bet against him. But uh, John certainly happy fighting, moving backwards. I think uh, in the uh, in the interim there, Josh was being told by his corner that he just needs to cut the uh, ring off and make John go toe to toe. Yeah. Cutting the ring off, changing the angle, he'll close that distance. Nice left, looping left there from John. Doesn't find a home this time. Got to give it to Josh, he doesn't take a backward step, he just keeps moving forward. You're, you're absolutely right, Lee. He needs to change the, uh, the trajectory of, of this fight. Warning from the ref there. Nice body shot from John.
The court, I'll tell you what, each corner is making more noise than the other. We see Josh getting frustrated here. Both corners willing their fighters on here. Here we go. Oh. Nice left right there from Corteus. Yeah. Good. End uh... of round three, three down, one to go. Yeah, good couple of hunters there to finish the end of the round there from Josh. Close the hood, grab the keys, baby. gentlemen there's only three minutes left in it everyone's excited to see what's going to happen a lot more action this round so far josh must be feeling the pressure but then so would john you know john may not be ahead on points he thinks that he is <laughs> and that seems to be the story of the evening, you know, just Josh just missing by millimetres and Corteos managing to land most of his punches. Yeah. That's the first time Josh has got his foot outside and uh, had some success there in the clinch. Corteus breathing heavily. There's not much left in it. It's going to come down to the wire. Corteos, Richards, who's going to take away the win? Each corner thinks that they're leading. Come on, Josh. One minute to go. <laughs> 60 seconds left. John keeping Josh at length with that jab. Final 30 seconds. Corteos, I think, is starting to run out of gas, guys. I think he knows what's left in this fight and he'll be able to make it, but there's not much left in the tank. Big swing and a miss from Corteus. There they go into the grapple. We're only seconds away from the main event of the evening and it's all over! Big round of applause to my fighters. Great contest. Don't go anywhere. We want EP 
Thank you for a great night, Dom. Thanks for being here. Thank you very much. I enjoyed it. And also Lee. Thanks so much, Lee Woodward. Thanks for uh, thanks for your your debut night on the cans. Yes, yes, it has been, guys. And thank you so much. Thanks so much, everybody. Have a good night. Ladies and gentlemen, after four rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecard. It is a unanimous decision. Jeff Eddy, Peter Flaherty, and Paul Lee had it 40 36 for your winner by unanimous decision. Red Corner! John Paul Gethorst! Territory, take us through the fight. What made you think that you won the fight unanimously? I boxed. That's the main thing. We went for boxing in this one. I always go for power, but now I learned how to box. I'm fucking. I'm sorry. Thank you so much, coach. Thank you everyone for coming. Thank you for my family. Mental warfare, baby. I got to ask you. You got the fever now as a pro. One fight, one win. What's next for yourself besides next Saturday? Have you got anything planned in February, March 2022? Or are you just going to save for the moment? I'm going to go back training, like we always do. Get my mental warfare gym up in the map. It's in Melbourne. Look out for us. Look out for mental warfare. We're getting ready. We're getting better. Sell! Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, John Cortejos. All right, we're going to get some uh, words here from Josh Bummer Richards. <laughs> Josh, unfortunately, it was not the W that you wanted. I have to ask you the question. Pro debut. They always say you learn more from a loss than a win. What can you take from today? What you may need to do more of? And do you agree with the judges' scorecard in your opinion? No, you know, I don't know how they got that. That's off to John. 
come a long way to get to this fight, but unanimous. No, I don't want to judge the judges there. You know, but fair is fair, good on him. I was going to ask you again there, what can you take, as I said, a fighter always learns more from a loss than a win. I know it's hard to digest right now, but if you were to take it in, what do you think could, you could have done more in this fight, in your opinion? I thought I won, so I'm going to have to look at the tape and see how we go. Regardless, I'm sure you want to thank your corner, your friends, your family for helping you get here today. Yeah, I want to thank Jackie Gallagher, all my mates, sponsors, um, and we'll be here again. I'm going to ask the question, since you thought it was a close fight, etc., compared to the judges' scorecard, would you like a rematch? I'd love a rematch. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that brings us to the end of Fight Night 56. Courtesy of Nick London, the VABL and the Combat Sports Board of Victoria. My name is Perry Kale. Honour and pleasure being your master of ceremonies, everyone. Have a good night, everyone. Please drive safely and see you next time.